Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So this is my uh, project car. It's a 2007 Chevy Uplander. So I fixed everything about the car for it to be registered, except except for the airbag light. It is on. So I went underneath the the chairs, these two chairs, and look at the connections and i think everything is okay and i tested uh, tested means uh, i checked which connection is which so i think the airbag is right over there that the airbag is over there because i disconnected this this is the power this is the seat belt airbag is right over there and the airbag light is, is still on so my last resort I think it's the airbag sensors and there is no video online or even pictures uh, regarding the location of the airbag sensors of this vehicle so that's what I'm gonna share today so some airbag sensors you can reach by hand with the Chevy Uplander I don't think you can because the sensors are here let me get a tripod Sensors are here. This is the passenger sensor, airbag sensor, and this is the driver's. So, I ordered online. I gotta uh, use one, because these are expensive. And I don't know if it's really broken. I just said I'm gonna change it and see if my problem disappears so it's just a process of elimination and in ordering this the part number should be the same although the, sometimes they look the same it should be the same so this is the original and this is the one that I bought and arrived today so brand new I think it will cost you around 120 bucks and where is the okay to remove it remove the clip pull the yellow tab now you can press here there you go it's free let's put it on by the way Uh, before doing this make sure you remove the connections for your battery you don't want any accidents with your airbag while you're messing with the sensors because uh, especially buying a used sensor Oops, I made a boo-boo. It's the other way around. Sorry. It's supposed to be like this.
the other one on. So when, when I was looking for the sensors, like I said, I can't find anything online. And then I looked underneath and saw the orange tab. And I said, there is no way that I can reach this area with a tool. get another tool so in inserting your your connection just push it so if it's not the same let me tighten this Alright, so insert it. So if you use the if you use a different part number, there's a good chance that it will not fit because of the grooves of the connections. Okay, so and then insert your orange, I think this is your safety tab. I'll insert this, just push it in. Okay, so it's good now i just need to connect the battery and check for the air light bag if it's still on so that's it for now i hope i helped anybody who has the same problem with the airbag staying on after you checked all the connections inside maybe it's your sensors and uh, what else that's it Hope you guys uh, click like and subscribe and use my Amazon link. It's not going to cost you anything, but it will help my channel. So that's it. Thanks for watching.